let's dive into long-nosed chimeras. Go ahead and smash that like button. If you're new here, I'm all things marine. Go ahead and click that subscribe button if you love the ocean as much as I do. And make sure you smash that notification bell as well so you don't miss out on any of the weird ocean creatures that I talk about. Long-nosed chimeras get their name from their long snouts and they are also a part of the group called Rhino Chimeridae. These are thought to be some of the oldest fish around today by some scientists and they are cartilaginous fish much like sharks are. They are sometimes even referred to as ghost sharks. Adding to the shark similarities, they also have no scales. They can grow up to about 5 feet in length and they have teeth that resemble a rodent's teeth. Their tail is also very long and resembles a whip. Their snout is very receptive and possesses a large amount of nerve endings which allows for them to locate their prey in the dark, dark depths that they thrive in. Their dorsal fin has a large venomous spine which acts as a defense against predators if they are grabbed. Their pectoral fins are very sizable and wide and look like wings, giving them the impression that they are flying through the water. Long-nosed chimeras tend to consume shrimp, crabs, or other invertebrates near the bottom, and they can be found as deep as 6,500 feet. Not much is really known about these strange and mysterious creatures as a result of where they live, and they are very rarely seen by scientists. There are eight species of long-nosed chimeras, and they are also referred to as ratfish probably as a result of their rodent-like teeth and their appearance in general. I hope you all enjoyed learning about this creature, and shout out to I don't know what to call my channel for suggesting chimeras.